Back, we'll hit five basic guillotine grips, right? So, one I like a lot, you got short, stubby arms, right? So I literally put the hand in like this, so we get to here, and I'm gonna grab my own fingers. When I'm in here, I'll grab my fingers like this, and I'm gonna cinch, flex, let, cinch up like that, right? So we're in like this, whether we're standing on the ground, whatever, I'm grabbing my fingers, I'm cinching, and pulling up high like this. Got a shorter arm, bad shoulders, that's easier for me, right? Now, if you got great shoulders, there's some awesome ones you can do. We get in here, we get the hook grip, right? Arm comes up, we get a hold it like this, and the arm comes over for a lot of these other grips you like to use, right? The hook grip, make that nice little okay sign, right? Go here, you reach over, you grab it with your fingers, pull up like this, hook grip, right? So right here, you grab it, you pull, and you set up high like this. It's a beautifully tight one, right? Yeah, my shoulders are not great, so I don't like that one much, right? Next, we did reverse gable. So gable grips here, reverse, opposite way. That's all it is, right? Again, people with good shoulders. So we're here, arm goes over, go and set up, you flip the arm over, and again, we're here like this, and it's on the top of the back, right? It's really tight choke. You sit out that space really well, you're in a nice and tight. So from the ground, these are really easy to high elbow. He's in there, we're set up, and when they flip that arm over, you can put the leg over like I talked about in the other video. We're here, the arm's nice and high. It's a really tight show, right? We're here, cinch in, great spot to be, right? So getting that elbow over helps a lot. Next one we have the McKinsey team. This guy was really famous in the UFC for like, uh, like 10 years ago, probably, right? Like 10 years ago. Oh, 10 years ago, McKinsey team. Dude had like long, skinny guy, right? So he'd put the arm in there, his other hand would meet it, and he'd grab his fingertips and curl it up like this, right? Really long arms though. So he'd get in here, get that arm in nice and deep like that, right? Turn this way. Boop. Nice and deep like that, and he'd grab his fingers here and curl up like that. So as he's setting up the choke, he'd be in there, and he'd get a hold of this thing, and just right into it. Really unique and interesting show. We've got a lot of people with like 10 people in a row or something like that. It's a really awesome show. Again, long arm people, really easy one to hit, right? So another high shoulder one that people like. When you're like this, I'll hit the S grip, right? So go in here, you're up here, and then again, you get like that, right? You're here, up over, but S grip, right? So you're literally gripping like that, right? So S grip, we're in nice and tight. Grab here, up over, there's the S grip there, right? Really simple. Easy grips, try them out switch when you like. If you got short arms, probably use number one like I do. If you got nice long arms, try that one. So thank you, sir. Yes, sir. Easy day.